This is a special report on the visit of the Premier of Alberta, Ed Stelmack, to the Peace Country. On this day, he visited Grand Prairie, Beaver Lodge, and also Wembley. He speaks today on the state of the Alberta government and the future of the River of Death and Discovery Dinosaur Museum near Wembley. We had an earlier projection of a fairly large uh, uh, deficit. Again, not on the operating side, but on the construction side, on the infrastructure side. Our operations are balanced uh, coming into this year, but uh, we're continuing to invest in infrastructure because uh, it's an excellent time to build, as many of the municipal officials know here. We're getting some really, really good temps. Uh, I can predict that the first quarterly statement that's going to come out in the province is going to show uh, a deficit because uh, we got hit with the dollar exchange. It's been up to 98 cents, 99, down to 93. I don't know what it's today. I think it's about 94 cents. But, you know, we're going in the right direction. Uh, we do issue quarterly statements. Uh, I will work with the ministers. Um, we do have, uh, you know, the sustainability fund. It's in good shape. Uh, we needed about a billion out of it, uh, you know, to to cover off this deficit. And the one thing I want to reassure everyone here: there's still sometimes uh, uh, Albertans are confused. But what is a deficit? And what is a debt? We don't have any debt. It is a deficit, but we have a large separate savings fund to cover any deficit that may occur uh, this year. But we've got a long way to go. We got set back a little bit uh, this uh, this month, uh, uh, and it was the X factor in the budget. The X factor to me are, are those factors you cannot predict. And one of them is weather, and as uh, you know, we're going through a bit of drought in this area, but. Uh, uh, the issue down south, especially through Medicine Act, uh, having traveled through there last week, we'll probably be there for a few years. Uh, to uh, It's not only the, the personal losses, but it's uh, the river sloping, a uh, huge number of bridges are blown out both in the county and in the municipality, so dedicated about 203 million to that. Horse fire activity is reasonable this year, the way I think we're not spending a lot of money, so that looking pretty good. So we're working through. I can't make a uh, commitment, uh, but I, I'm well aware of your November 1st date. It's kind of, it's in the middle of a fiscal period. Uh, no excuse, but you know, <laughs> uh, but it's like, let's put the crop in the bin first and then we'll uh, make the decisions. I know that Lindsay definitely has money set aside. Uh, I'll talk to Cindy. There is some, there are some municipal sustainability funds, but not the large amount, you know, to offset. But uh, I encourage you, uh, don't lose any uh, uh, momentum. It, it is a good idea, and uh, uh, we'll keep working towards uh, a resolution. And that wraps up the special report from Premier Ed Skelmack. From Wembley, this is Ken Connors for discoverthepeacecountry.com.